they've self-declared interim secretary general of the mainstream opposition Kibosi party Sengezo Chabangu may have won his court case against 14 members of the party that he recalled from parliament but that doesn't stop him from continuously being a much maligned man within the structures of the party speaking to AVG news from Luanda Triple C interim chairperson for South Africa Mr Trust Nlovo says that despite them knowing Chabang from way back he is still an imposter sent by President Emerson Nangakwa's ruling Zanu PF party to destabilize the opposition uh, in short what uh, happened what transpired uh, on the triple c case where uh, it was dismissed by the courts i think our uh, legal team will have to start after studying they will tell us what is the way forward regarding that and what they think whether they will still pursue in it in courts uh, you know appealing uh, and uh, arguing it on certain points of law but my preliminary thoughts on it is that uh, uh, Shavangu is a, a disgrace, it's a shame. I think this is the optics on the ground that is, has betrayed the struggle, has betrayed the aspirations of the people. And the people, uh, the fact that he claims he was there from uh, the beginning is a show that uh, he was deployed uh, by the uh, regime, uh, you know, as an infiltrator uh, to uh, do what he is doing now, uh, because the infiltrators, they have a time to strike. Uh, when the mass democratic movement was formed, uh, a lot of them were deployed among us. So you will only see them when they start acting in favor of the state. It did, we, one could not uh, uh, accept a person who is uh, uh, fighting on the side of the regime, uh, on the side of the dictator. Uh, what we are witnessing here, uh, it's uh, like uh, history repeating itself in the same way where Mr. Monzora allowed himself to be used and he he took everything that belonged to the mdc alliance led by uh, advocate nelson chamisa in the weaponized through using weaponized uh, the law uh, captured courts and uh, all that so here is the uh, same as Oshabangu. Uh, it's being used as a conduit of the state and the regime to destroy the aspirations or the gains of the progressive mass movement uh, party, Triple C. Uh, it is a shame everyone can glaringly tell that this was not uh, proper, the, this was not expected. And, uh, uh, you know, I can only describe him as a thief. Uh, he wants to steal what belongs to the people, what belongs to the true leader of the people who is Advocate Nelson Chamisa. When Advocate Nelson Chamisa says he doesn't know Senge Shabangu, people, oh, oh, I think they misinterpret that. He does not know him as the secretary of the Triple C because that position do not exist. So there are no contradictions there, but I see uh, the media pundits and other uh, people, they want to uh, reflect it as if he means that he has never met him. We know him as a, a, one of the people, as a Zimbabwean, as one of the people was in the MDC, but in the Triple C, he is not known as the SG. He is not known as one of us in terms of the new uh, structures or the new system. So he doesn't 
uh, makes sense for people to keep on saying why is the president saying you know saying he does not know him he does not know him as the sg he is not known as someone who is holding any strategic position in the triple c you know he's a non-entity so i do not uh, want to dwell so much on the uh, antics of Segezo. Segezo is a, is a betrayal of the struggle, is a sellout. Uh, you, you can describe him as a thief. That is the voice of Trust in Lofu, chairperson of Triple C in South Africa. Uh, meanwhile, Segezo Chabangu spoke to AVG News, stating that the triple c is going to fail the people in the forthcoming by elections that have been declared for the 9th of december we are going to the by elections we are preparing these by elections we are preparing for the nomination court on tuesday the 7th uh, so we are placing candidates we are not going to have another primary elections but we are going to consider those uh, leaders or those uh, candidates who were chosen by the people and but were elbowed uh, out by the the system uh, so we are going to give them a chance to to represent the communities once more so yes we are occupying every democratic zone which uh, can be created by zanu that can be created by whichever means so we are not going to leave any any fighting zone uh, uh, unattended so we are going to go for the by elections